it's a, a timer seen in a RX logics. So the basically work of a timer is to generate a delay into your program and the delay will be as per the programmer. So into the RX logics a three type of timers inside T on, T off and RTO. Timer on delay, timer off delay and return to timer. So uh, this is the uh, truth table we can say that uh, of a timers. So first of a T on. So as per the name, the timer will get on after delay time. T off, the timer will get off after delay time. And retentive timer on will on the timer after delay, but will not get turned off automatically. To turn it off, you need to reset the timer. Okay, into a timer of delay, when the on to off input will goes, then and then will start the timer or enable the timer, otherwise not. And other two, when the input bit is on, the timer will get enabled and will count the timer second and after time delay will get on. When you put it off, will directly get off. And uh, into a return T, you can see that when you put the on input, the timer will get activated and will generate a output done bit after time delay. But when you will put it off input, will not get off. To make it off, you need to reset the timer. So let's see how it works into RS logics. So this is I uh, did the program for the timer. So first of all, uh, I put three inputs, uh, I0, 0, I0, I01 and I002. These three are the inputs bit. Here is the T on, T off and retentive timer on. So into three timer, four are the basic parameters you have to set, three basic parameters. First of all the timer address, timer address is I put the timer T40 second timer is T41 and T42 base time is nothing but the multiplying factor with the preset value so I put here 1.0 you can change it by the 0 0.01 and 0 0.01 0 0.01 so I put here a 1 if you want to count the milliseconds into the parameter of millisecond, you can do it 0 1. Okay, so as I did into a second t of time period, so the base time multiplied with the preset is equals to your seconds. So here 1.5 1 multiplied with 5 is a 5 second by delay into a second 0 0.01 multiplied with the 500, so with the 5 second with delay, and into a third I generated. 10 seconds delay okay so uh, these are the three timers this animal and this is a turn bit so turn bit will activate it after your delay that you want in the t on and rt into a t off the turn bit will activate it on the input will go to on to off but will be turned off as per its property the timer of delay after delay of the 5 second will get off so let's see how it works uh, let me go to the uh, download yes yes I want to go online then start run okay yes I want to run it so you can see these two power lines are get activated so we can now work between two power line first of all see let's see a T on bit so let me turn it on okay you have to watch on the accumulator time this is our preset time when the preset is close to accumulator this turn bit will activate and you can see toggle bit you can see signs are counted when will be equal turn bit is that when i will put it off toggle bit see it's zero you can see that it's zero and also done bit is zero 
so this is the t on time let's see a uh, retentive timer what i okay let's see first a uh, timer of a uh, delay what i say into a timer of delay if you will put it on will show you a done beat and also enable but will not start counting it will start the counting when you are putting to on to off input okay i put it on to off and it's counting a sec millisecond so the as per the time base 500 equals to 500 you can see the done bit is off okay let's see again toggle bit is on now watch out the accumulator off and done bit after 5 second done bit will off you can see that okay so this is the work of a timer of delay now let's see a retentive timer on when i will put this to the on it counts a second and i put the delay of 10 second okay when i will put it off you can see the i put the input off that accumulator stops but doesn't stop at the zero you can see into the on time the input is zero the accumulator will set automatically to the reset point but here the accumulator doesn't stop so what happened when i will start this again the accumulator will start from 9 and after one second you will get activated see in one second you will see a done bit but when you will put it off will not get done bit zero okay so as i told you you need a reset you need to reset this timer to clean this done bit so let uh, do that let's go to the offline mode yes okay mm -hmm. okay now let me take one rug uh, and one input bit and into the timer you can see a one reset it is a reset so uh, let's take i 0 3 this is the input bit address and the reset what i want to reset a timer timer 24 uh, t42 t42 okay so this will be the timer reset let's uh, see how it works so let me first verify this rug it's verified there isn't any error you can see over here there isn't any error so let's go to a download yes i have download yes Yes. Go to the run. I have done this. Okay. Now you can see that the turn bit is here at the. Let me just push uh, on. You can see accumulator is zero, and the turn bit is also zero. Let's start it again. Let's see, toggle the bit. Your accumulator will start. You will stop between. The accumulator will carry that number. same will not get reset you can toggle the bit you can stop the bit any time if you want to reset you just reset button so we'll get accumulator reset and again you want to start we'll take a 10 second delay you can see after 10 second the done bit will be shown yeah done bit is activated now you need to reset it again toggle bit and reset so here we seen three timers a timer on delay timer delay and a retentive timer retentive timer having their own application into the work okay so practice it thank you